The maker of an extremely spicy tortilla chip marketed as the One Chip Challenge is pulling its product from store shelves. And this comes after kids and teens all across the country got sick after participating in this challenge. And one father says that includes six students at Forest Park Elementary in Boynton Beach. The challenge involves eating just one chip, but that chip is described as one of the spiciest in the world. CBS 12's Amber Robb joins us in Riviera Beach now with more on this challenge and why doctors say this chip is so dangerous. Amber. The one chip challenge comes in a box that looks like this. It's in the shape of a coffin and it's got a skull on it along with snake running across. It then says at the bottom inside one extremely hot tortilla chip and you can't find it in stores anymore because it was removed from shelves this morning after several people need medical attention after eating the chips. Let's see if it's hotter than last year. Videos like this are all over the social media site TikTok. <laughs> there are people trying the Pocky One Chip Challenge. It's a challenge where people are encouraged to eat an extremely hot tortilla chip, wait as long as possible before eating or drinking anything, and post their reactions online. Videos show people gagging, begging for water, coughing, and some even ending up in the hospital. Oh my God, bro. While the challenge debuted in 2016, we're seeing more children across the country participate now. Dr. Ann Fisher says a challenge like this is extremely dangerous for any person at any age. I certainly wouldn't have them do the one chip challenge. I would certainly get those peppers away from them. I would certainly talk about it at school or discourage it in their in their family groups and in their Facebook pages. According to the company's website, the chips contain Naga Viper pepper and Carolina Reaper pepper, which Dr. Fisher says is the most potent pepper in the world. And that pepper is filled with capsaicin, which is uh, really treated as a biochemical natural pesticide. And it's used in bear spray, pepper spray. So it's very potent. It's the most potent. One, two, three, go. When people ingest capsaicin, doctors like Sunil Bali say the side effects can be dangerous. It can cause nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, but then if it gets aerosolized, if you aspirate it, it can lead to serious uh, respiratory derangement, so it can lead to respiratory failure. Dr. Bally says right now researchers don't know enough about consuming high levels of capsaicin, but social media sites like TikTok are making kids more susceptible to falling victim. They are willing to take risks because they want to look cool in front of their friends. They, they want to try whatever everybody else is trying. So they see this on social media. I guarantee it that without telling their parents, they're going to do it. In a statement, the company said the chip is intended for adults only and, quote, not for children or anyone sensitive to spicy foods or who has a food allergy, is pregnant, or has underlying health conditions. The company is offering refunds on the single-serve product. Reporting live in Riviera Beach, I'm Amber Rob, CBS 12 News. And a family in Massachusetts saying that their 14-year-old son died after taking part of this social media challenge last week. They're still waiting on an autopsy to confirm the cause of death.